Hi, I am Dr. Prabhakar. I am a lead consultant, uh, general and elite specialties at Aster Whitefield Hospital. Uh, today, I am going to talk about uh, one of the most important problems in the anus is anal fistula. Anal fistula is a pus discharge. Uh, usually, patients notice around the anus. It is one of the most irritating problems because on and off there is a pus discharge, there can be irritation uh, and pain around the anus uh, while sitting as well as while passing stools. What are the causes of anal fistula? Anal fistula most commonly is secondary to a pus formation around the anus. There are anal glands inside the anal mucosa that is a back passage which can get spontaneously infected. The cause for infection can be spontaneous as well as secondary to passing hard motions. Uh, like how we get uh, normally pimples, these anal glands can get infected. They lead to a pus formation and uh, slowly the size of this pus will increase and because of the pressure it might burst open. Secondarily, other causes are, uh, there can be a spontaneous uh, fistula formation that means uh, the, without any abscess also, the pus can start uh, forming. And there are other uh, known, lesser known causes like uh, chronic infection of the anal canal uh, uh, including Crohn's disease or tuberculosis and immunosuppressive conditions like HIV infections. What are the symptoms of anal fistula? Commonly, uh, people notice pus discharge around the anus. It is a liquid discharge whenever they sit or whenever they pass tools, uh, they notice it. Associated with pain around the anus, pain can be very really laggy or it can be severe at times when the abscess formation is there. That means when the pus formation is there. Other uh, symptoms are uh, uh, irritation around the anus, Patient can have a constipation normally. Rarely, it can lead to an incontinence where there is no control for uh, passing stools. Uh, and recurrent abscess formation, recurrent pain around the anus. These are the common symptoms of anal fistula. What are the tests they conduct to confirm anal fistula? Whenever somebody experiences these symptoms like pain, pus discharge around the anus, one should con uh, consult a doctor immediately, preferably a surgeon. Uh, he will take a thorough history and uh, examine you initially with a per-rectal examination, that is examination of the anus. So with the finger examination, initially doctor will examine, then they will use a special instrument called proctoscope with the illumination so that they can examine the opening thoroughly. Additionally, we also advise a, a sigmoidoscopy test where they put a camera inside the anus uh, to study uh, the anal fistula better. So imaging techniques also uh, will be used like a endosonic ultrasound and uh, MRI scan of the uh, anus to understand the course of these fistulas better. If above said symptoms present, it's better to meet a medical specialist, especially the surgeon, for better understanding of symptoms and treatment options for anal fistula.